McDermott considers Angelin very special and the fact that BP came to us early on and has utilized us for all phases. BP allowing us to do commissioning is a great milestone for us. It allows us to do EPCIC work and bring the full global footprint of McDermott to demonstrate our ability to perform commissioning and perform it efficiently. We are the first contractor who have been awarded this opportunity and I take great pride being the first commissioning manager to do a BP work at our yard. One of the benefits of McDermott doing the commissioning is that we can stagger and overlap the commissioning activities with the mechanical completion, which allows us to compress our schedule. Safety is important for us, it's very, very important. Whenever commissioning takes over, we execute the work using something called a permit to work. So only commissioning team is allowed where commissioning happens. The EIT building is the electrical and instrumentation building. It's really the brains of the operation. In Angelin, we have 4,100 individual items, individual components. So what we do is we break the whole project into small chunks. Each chunks, we call them systems. We have 60 systems. So when we want to do a work, we turn it on and work on a live circuit. And once it is finished, it stays on. When the EIT building is up and running, it brings everything together in an integrated approach to allow the facility to run. But it also allows for the telecommunications to talk to the other facilities, and then that's fed back remotely to BP so they can operate the facility. Once commissioning is finished in the yard, the facility is then taken offshore, and then we do some additional offshore commissioning prior to handing over the facility. Commissioning has got a unique role of handing over the project or the systems to the client. So having a nice relationship with the client is very, very, very important. We were fortunate enough on Angelin to have a very strong collaborative relationship with BP. We see Angelin as very significant for McDermott to be able to deliver an EPCIC project by working in his one team.